Okay, everyone, we are hopping back into Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. Welcome, everyone. We are doing a showcase on Physical Zamasu here. Now, if I'm being honest with you guys, I'm going to cut to the chase right away. He's not great. Okay? <laughs> He's not great. He's a new unit, though, so we are going to do a uh, showcase for him and just see how he, he can kind of pair up. But he, uh, oh, man, he could have been a lot better. I'm After the his video, I'm actually going to do the STR Mai showcase and I'm hoping she's a little bit better but we have a uh, physical Zamasu here he has a decent kit which we'll go over at the end of the video here he's on a lot of good teams uh, but it's just he's not great man he's just not great his stats are very very bad I gave my physical Zamasu here an extra defensive boost and uh, some critical and additional just to do, like skill orbs but honestly that's not going to matter too much I do have him in SA10 I only have him in one copy, so he's at 55%. We're going to be hopping into a couple different events, just so I can show you guys that he uh, he's very mid, if not worse. <laughs> but uh, without further ado, let's dive into the first event. Okay, so we're hopping into an event. Now we are on uh, the first stage here in the red zone versus the Red Ribbon Army. We're going to take it kind of nice and slow and see how we can uh, how he looks, but... Um, honestly, he's not going to be looking too great. While mortal endeavors will inevitably become wicked, corrupted, marred by the dead. That intro is so good, by the way. That intro is so good. So, okay, we're going to do it. We're just going to put him in uh, the first slot and see what kind of damage we take. Now, he does have evasive in his passive, um, dodging and stuff like that, but... Man, it's just all luck, man. It's all RNG. So, he gets hit and he takes 45k from a normal attack. Yep, 43k. On super, we do raise attack and defense, but that's kind of the reasoning why I went behind a little more additional for him, just to potentially get a second super. So after we super, not too bad for damage, but again, he's not doing too much, man. He's not doing too much. After he invades an attack, he is the support unit. Um, again, we'll go over his kit, but... He's not that great, unfortunately. I mean, these banner units, man, they gotta they gotta make, like, banner units as good as STR Piccolo and uh, Yajirobe and stuff like that. But they decided, like, eh, Physical Zamasu, let's just drop a turd next to the number one unit in the game. That's just what they pretty much did. Ooh. I am Demon King Piccolo Reborn! I will once again reign as the world's strongest! By the way, World Tournament Piccolo is slowly becoming my favorite uh, TUR. He's getting there, man. He's getting there. I'm going to leave my Zamasu in slot 2. We'll float off the Rose. But World Tournament Piccolo is... He's phenomenal. He's one of the characters I recommended in my Red Coin video to uh, purchase with Red Coins. I think he's worth it, man, if you don't have a copy. He's just too... He's got too much in his kit. He does too much. Plus, he can tank damage, too. He has a transformation. Oh man. So mine uh Rose or Tech the Monsters at six million attacks that here, turn one that he's been on. Get some nice little buffs there, and then Rose will get the finishing blow, so that's good for him. But again, we're mainly looking at Zamasu. I just want to see what kind of damage we can take and give out. The damage he's gonna be giving out is pretty much nothing, but alright, good, 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 good. So this could potentially be very, very bad, but this is a good chance for us to um, kind of test his capability here. Now if you see, his key is always struggling as well. He always needs six key, I swear. They didn't give him key, they didn't give him anything, man. What were you guys thinking, Akatsuki? Bandai, come on. I just, I don't get it, man. What were they, what was going through their heads? Like, they had to at least test this unit, right? They literally, like, took a turd. Gave it the name Zamasu and just plopped it out on this banner with Tech Zamasu. I, I just, I don't get it, man. I don't get it. But let's see what he does. And we're not dodging, so 76k. Oh, 22. Alright, alright, yeah, yeah. Wow. He's fantastic, Bandai. Thank you for the banner unit I can enjoy using. Great. He's phenomenal. I hope they drop more units like this. <laughs> like, dude, what were they thinking, for real? I just, I don't get it, man. 
It's almost as bad as uh, dropping the number one unit in the game and then giving him the wrong name. I'm still mad about that. <laughs> I think the whole community is kind of salty about that, but as you can see, guys, there's not much to showcase here. He's just awful, like plain and simple. I'm going to put a uh, Zamasu in slot one there. We'll float off World Tournament Piccolo. I could do his active skill, but I'm going to... We'll wait on that. But there's just not too much to showcase for physical Zamasu, dude. He's not good. Like, I, I still... I just, I know I'm ranting now, but I don't know what they were thinking, man. At least, the, at least the STR Mai has some, like, good things in her kit, which we'll go over her next in the next showcase, but... Man, for poor physical Zamasu, dude. And he has a cool little intro. He's stealing, or, uh, stirring the tea when there's a super class enemy. It looks really good, but... Bummer, man. Just unfortunate. But at least we got the number one unit in the game with the wrong name. This is slowly turning into a just hate on Bandai and Akatsuki uh, showcase. <laughs> but he's just not good, man. World Tournament Piccolo looking good as normal. Give me the additional. There you go, buddy. 8.32, and he's not linked up very well at all. This Piccolo is so good, man. He is at uh, he's at 79% actually with um, level 10 links. All right, so I'm gonna keep Zamasu on rotation here. <laughs> um, actually, real quick, let me look at his kit. Hmm. Man, okay. We'll let you get those. We'll put him in slot two. Hopefully that Rose doesn't, or uh, text the monster there doesn't additional super and take out that SDR one. I think he probably will, because he's the number one unit in the game. Okay, good. Shouldn't take him out? Okay, perfect. 2.53, his attack stat is literally garbage. So he's not going to do any damage for you. And he's still not dodging, so great. And 6.85, Rose will get another finishing blow here. Good, good, good. Ah, oh, man. Way to fumble a unit that came out with the number one unit in the game. Just a bummer, man. It really is. Ooh, we got locked in slot one. That's okay. What we're going to do is give them all to him. You can have those, and then our tech... LR, Zamasu, and Rose at the end there can get an Ultra as well. We'll take some extra buffs. What are we going to take for damage here? Oh, wow. He actually did some good damage there. I was with damage reduction and getting a hit a few times. Now, AGL Zamasu is going to be untouchable after he supers with his damage reduction and raising his attack and defense. He is seriously one of my favorite EZAs of all time. Like, hands down, man. He is very, very good. But physical uh, Zamasu and Gawa or just physical Zamasu with banner unit. Thumbs down for me, dog. Cannot approve. 10 out of 10. Highly don't recommend. He's not good. Of course, we're in the transformation. Okay. You know, we may, uh. I'm probably gonna hop out and we'll cut and go to a different fight. Get a little more Zamasu against this super class enemy. I love that transformation, though. Alright. Okay, so we are going to be hopping into a brand new event, Fighting Legend Goku GT Edition. Now, we should get the intro animation as well. Hopefully here. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Unless I played it last night. Nope, here we go. Oh, oh, oh. Yo! The intro animation actually isn't that bad, like, honestly. It's not that bad. Okay, let's let him sit in slot one. Type disadvantage. Let's see. Uh, let's see this guy do nothing and get hit. Maybe we can get a dodge. I don't know. We'll see. Nope. We're gonna take. Uh, I'm just gonna take damage. Okay. Cool. Three point four eight million attack stat. That is linked up very well. That is with the freeze freeze the support, and that's it. That's all he does. He will get you killed. He is not good. I just, I don't know what they were thinking, man. Awful unit, Bandai. Unfortunately. We're gonna get him on rotation one more time here, but... Uh, as you guys can see, he's not good. Just unfortunate, man. 
But I will say, at least they didn't drop the ball with the EZA Zamasu and the Tech Fusion Zamasu. It needs a different name, but at least he is number one, in my opinion. I can see you arguing uh, Bulma, and then I have Piccolo right behind those two, Orange Piccolo, but it's unfortunate, man. So let's see here, let's see, let's see. What do we got, what do we got? I'm going to, um, oh man. I want to get him at least one dodge here. We got to get a dodge. It's got to happen. It's got to happen. He's got it in his passive unless there's something I'm missing. Or he's just crap. 3.62. Animations are okay. I mean, I just... There finally is a die. Okay, now they're coming. Okay. So that is pretty much all I wanted to show you guys. That he is... He has dodge in his kit, but it's as you can see, it's not happening that often. It's a chance, man. It's just not worth running. It is not worth running, but... Let me know in the comments down below what you think of physical Zamasu. Um, I'm going to actually hop out here, and we will go over his kit. Oh, okay, so, physical banner unit, who is, a uh, crap, Zamasu here. His leader skills, Patara, or Future Saga, key plus three, HP attack and defense, 130%. His super attack, the Fierce God Slicer, raises attack and defense for one turn, causes supreme, supreme damage to enemy, and lowers attack. I will say I do like the lowering attack fart for m typical events, but a lot of bosses don't even let you do that, so it's not that viable. Passive skill, Cloudy T. If there's a superclass enemy at start of character's attack in turn, activates the entrance animation once only. An attack and defense plus 50% and chance of evading the enemy's attack, including super, plus 20% for the rest of battle. Attack and defense plus 150 plus an additional attack and defense plus 50. And chance of evading the enemy's attack, including super, plus 30% when performing a super attack. Didn't see that, but we got hit a lot. Um... Key plus one up to four, plus an additional attack and defense plus 50, up to 200 at the start of each turn when there is a super class enemy. Extreme class allies attack and defense plus 30%, plus an additional attack and defense plus 20. And chance of performing a critical hit plus 10% for characters who also belong to the future saga category. Uh, future saga category allies key plus two for two turns after ev evading an attack. So, quickly to recap. Is he good? No. Does he have some good potential? Yes, for like when he gets an easy A in a few years here. He's got good stuff in his kit. He can dodge, but again, he's just not doing too much, man. They they should have made him a better support. I don't, I don't know, but it's unfortunate they dropped the ball on him, but it is what it is. That is the showcase for Physical Zamasu. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you're watching this right now, I'm actually currently on vacation with the lovely Monica. We are down in North Carolina, probably on the beach right now. But um, I'm trying to hit 1,000 subs on the channel. If you guys can please drop a like down below. Subscribe if you guys are new. Notification bells on and all that good stuff. Yada, yada, yada. <laughs> I'd appreciate it. But thank you guys so much for watching today's video. My name is Leap Games. I'm doing a ton of stuff and Dokkan content for you guys. I'll keep it coming. But thank you so much again for watching. Have an awesome, awesome, wonderful day. Comment what you think of Physical Zamasu. He's a turd. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Have a great day. Bye, guys.